Hello everyone, welcome to another video on the Fox Tech YouTube channel. This time we talk about live photos and how you can transfer the live photos from an iPhone to a Mac computer. Now, there are many things you should know about it. First of all, iPhone can take and play the live photos within the Photos app and the same stuff applies to the MacBook as well. So when you go inside all of your apps, keep in mind that you can only play it or play live photos using the actual Photos app. So this one right here, this is the app which you have to use. Because for example, I shared a live photo with myself through AirDrop and it just shows up into your in your finder and here no matter what you open it with you're just not going to be able to to just play it as it just doesn't work with it so the way how you can move the photos to the um, live photos to the Mac is by getting inside of the photos app on your MacBook like this and make sure that you connect your iPhone through a cable to a Mac. So you can see it's connected like this. And when you open up the Photos app, you have some sections on the left side, but Devices is one of them. And through Devices, you can access some different things and basically all of the photos. And when I switch to my iPhone and open up the photos, you can see that the last one is actually a live image. So if I hold down on it, it moves. This is, by the way, then Im the image which we created out of the thin air, which we just converted still image into live photo. I made a tutorial on that if you want to. But you can see that the latest one in my gallery is a live photo. So when I connected my iPhone to a computer and opened up the Photos app on the Mac, clicked on iPhone in here as a device, the latest picture, you can see that it is live photo. You cannot really see that, but you know, because I've just shown you that on the iPhone. So I can click on the latest image and import one picture and now it shows up inside of my imports and right now if I click in here I can even play it inside of my MacBook as well you can see that it is a live photo like this so if I play it it should yeah like you can see the movement right here so that's how you can transfer photos from the uh, iPhone the live photos to the Mac so you can play it inside in here inside of the photos app however if I just drag and drop the airdropped file. So if I airdrop the live photo in here and just move it over to my library inside in here. So I'm going to show it to you right now. So here is the image which I just airdropped to myself. I can add it inside of the photos app as well. So you can see there's the latest one right here. And if I open it up, it should still contain the live image. At least it should. So let me just try it with this one. Yeah, I have it like one more time. So I'm going to click on that. And this one should be a live photo as well. At least I did that in the past, like imported it in here. And yeah, this one is live photo. And I just used the very same method. So keep in mind that you can only play them within a, the Photos app on the Mac and you can connect it very easily using the Photos app and the cable method, basically. So that's everything what you need to know about it. And before I wrap up the video, I need to show you this little thing right here. So this is the Fox Tech educational platform, which you can join for free. It's linked down below in the description. So go ahead and check it out. And inside you can find other people who are learning as well already. And also free resources in the classroom section, like video editing courses and apps explanations and stuff which you may be interested in. So definitely go ahead and check it out. The link is going to be down below in the description. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you found it useful. See you guys later in the next tutorial.